Hey everyone, this is AI with TechSnap. In this video, we're going to fix a common problem in Suno. You generate a song that's almost perfect, but the ending feels rushed or just stops awkwardly. I'm going to show you how to craft a professional sounding outro using Suno's powerful extend feature. And hey, it's easier than you think. Let's get started. First things first, we need a song to use the extend feature on. So let's create one. We already covered how to create a song on Suno in my previous video, so be sure to check it out first. I'm right here on the create page. For the style description, I'm going to type this exactly. Now for the lyrics, you can keep it empty and let Suno generate them. But for this occasion, I'm going to put in a verse and a chorus that I really like. All right, Suno's doing its thing. And here we go. Let's have a quick listen. The coffee's cold, the morning's new. Another day, not much to do. Through the window pane, the world outside. Quiet place where feelings hide But there's a whisper in the breeze A simple truth among the trees That even after the longest night A flicker turns into a light Okay, I like the vibe of this first one. Let's select that one to work with. And just like that, we have our song currently at around 60 seconds. Okay, now go to the song that we just created from your workspace or library. And in Suno's new interface, you will notice this remix edit button. Go there and select the extend option from the drop down menu. And here you will notice a section called extend from field. This is where we tell Suno where to start the new section. So we need to find the exact moment where the new ending should begin. Listen carefully for when the last lyric or vocal happens. A flicker turns into a light. Okay, as you heard, on this track the last vocal completely ends at the 54 seconds mark. Try to be precise as much as possible here because this timestamp is the key to a smooth transition. Use the slider to mark the area of the 54 second point or you can type the timestamp here at the extend from field. This ensures the new part will pick up right where the original left off. Now here, you can write the lyrics to insert for our extending part. I'm just going to an outro for our example, but if you want, you can write any lyrics here to extend your song with more vocals. Remember the most important rule. Brackets are for musical directions, not lyrics. Since we want an instrumental outro, our entire prompt will be in brackets. For this example, I will go for a very simple prompt, cello outro. Before you hit create, let's adjust the settings. In the style box, add a few keywords for your new ending. I'll just type cello to guide the AI. Now for the sliders, weirdness. Turn this down to zero. We want a predictable, fitting ending, not something surprising. Style influence. Set this high around 95. This tells Suno to really focus on your new style words. Audio influence. Set this to 100%. This is critical. It forces the extension to stay in the same key and tempo as your original song. We are all set now. Give your new part a title and click Create. Suno will generate two different options for you. It's going to be interesting because our original song was acoustic and I requested a cello outro. Let's have a listen. Okay, that's really nice and follows the prompt well. Now notice here that what Suno gives us first are options for the second part of our song for us to select from. I'm 
I think I prefer this one. The cello has a bit more space to breathe. Let's go with this version. Now that we have selected our second part, click on the Get Full Song button. Great! Suno is now stitching our original song with the selected extension for the second part. And here is our full song, roughly around 90 seconds now, with an extended part. Let's give it a listen. The coffee's cold, the morning's new Another day, not much to do Through the window pane, the world outside A quiet place where feelings hide But there's a whisper in the breeze A simple truth among the trees That even after the longest night A flicker turns into a light Yes, that sounds great. The transition from acoustic song to the cello outro is quite smooth, and that's how we do it. Once all done, you can just export your new completed song. Okay, okay, I know that we gave a really basic prompt for our extension. Let's try one more example, but this time with a more detailed prompt. The more detail you give, the better the result. This one already sounds good. Let's pick it to create our full song. The coffee's cold, the morning's new. Another day, not much to do. Through the window pane, the world outside A quiet place where feelings hide But there's a whisper in the breeze A simple truth among the trees That even after the longest night Flicker turns into a light. That's nice. Transition is smooth again, and it beautifully keeps the same key and tempo from our original song. And that's it. By following these steps with the Extend feature, you can take any good Suno track and give it a great, polished ending. It's a simple process that makes a huge difference in the final quality of your music. I hope this guide was helpful. If it was, a like would be awesome. And be sure to subscribe to AI with Texan App for more tutorials like this one. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.